Hey everyone, welcome back to the Collector's Horde. This is my action figure review for Carnage from the Venom Pool BAF Wave, part of the Venom movie slash Maximum Venom Wave of Marvel Legends. All right, starting off, he's got three accessories. One is the uh, tendrils or spikes on his back that comes off, so that's pretty cool. Uh, he also comes with a extra head which I really like my it's a nice head uh, and then he also comes with the head for the BAF for Venom Pool all right get started here now I will start by saying that this is actually my least favorite carnage um, he is as you can see covered in more black and white like uh, the black is more like veins rather than being part of the symbiote like the other ones uh his the head he has here is the uh the knoll head uh, or cult of carnage head and it's got the little design right there that's kind of cool the design is more like his the red is like muscle, like bare muscles, uh, if you were to remove skin. And then he's got the black veins all covering that. But he is a near standard, you know, carnage character or carnage figure. He's got the, the clawed hands. He's got tendrils coming off of him, various places. Uh, Clawed feet. I don't know if the other ones had clawed feet. I have to double check. I can't remember. Um, the paint apps are on it are really good though. Um, it really captured the comic book uh, from that series uh, as far as the look overall, but again, still just not my favorite. And he's got the you know, typical articulation from Marvel Legends, but he's also got the bar by uh, shoulders here. So he can get a little bit more. Uh, but this is, you know, chest, waist, you know, the legs, the knees, biceps, and everything else. I will see, although he is not my favorite Carnage figure, uh, I really do like his alternate head, the way the black uh, and the eyes look. Uh, and, you know, overall, he is a really solid figure. He's solid. He stands properly. Um, mine didn't come with the, the bent knees or anything like that. And the tendrils do look nice coming off of the back of him like that. He did come with the extra head, which is great. Uh, I do kind of wish Mobius from the wave also came with an extra head. That would have been cool. Or even uh, Gwynnum, if she had come with a head without that tongue, that would have been great too. But leave me a comment down below what you think of him. Uh, did you like this design? Uh, what did you like about it? What didn't you like about it? Also, uh, go ahead and like and subscribe. And uh, remember to share the videos with your friends and out in other toy groups and everything else. As always, thanks for watching. And until next time, I'll catch you later.